Hey Toronto Maple Leaf fans, Mark Farrow with the Blue Line. And today we honor our longest serving captain, the Chief, George Armstrong. Let's do this. On July 6, 1930, George Armstrong was born in Skeet, Ontario. He would play all 21 seasons with the Toronto Maple Leafs and, as mentioned before, our longest serving captain in history. He would actually go on to score the last goal in the original six era in our 1967 Stanley Cup Final. Standing beside me here is a player's trophy that was given out for that 1967 Stanley Cup and, in fact, I've got his birth certificate and his stick that he used in the early 60s as a player and is a solid representative of the Toronto Maple Leafs winning four Stanley Cups. And just above my shoulder, a little hard to pull out today, would be George's rookie sweater when he would wear the number 20. And many people often say, well, I refer to George's number 10. What many people don't realize is the Maple Leafs would honor sweaters back then. And it wouldn't be until Sill Apps would give him the right to carry on and start to wear the number 10, which is what we would all know as George wearing. And how did he get his name the Chief? Well, it was presented to him as a ceremonial headdress from some of the locals when they mentioned to him, Big Chief, shoot the puck. Well, it would, it would be narrowed down for many decades, whether he was a scout, a coach, a player, or working with the Toronto Marlies as simply the Chief. A player that will never be forgotten, a solid mainstay, and literally one of the best players in Toronto Maple Leaf history. If you like seeing this and many other pieces of Toronto Maple Leaf history, I'm Mark Farrow with the Blue Line. Follow us everywhere.